you're not already accepting that things have changed, then you're in trouble. I think that most organisations, most businesses now are on the way. There's at least a kind of an acceptance there. Digital transformation is something that's relevant from a business point of view and a line of business perspective. And it shouldn't be assessed from an IT perspective. If I'm into agriculture, you know, there are solutions where I've seen solar powered, portable chemical assessment of soil uh, and water, it was in vineyard. So these vineyards uh, have digital transformation at their heart because it tells you when to water, when to fertilize, to gain the best return from the harvest on the vineyards, the best wines. And that's business specific, that's a vertical specific. So I think digital transformation is about being relevant to a line of business. I think it's about being relevant to a particular vertical and ensuring they're having the right conversations. But it's board level, this is a strategy this is about taking new products to market. The rules of business have not changed. It's just that technology enables those business decisions. So first, it must be a business decision. I do see too many digital transformation projects start in IT, uh, which I'm afraid is not the right place to start. I think that probably the era of kind of top-down decision making is, is, is maybe over. It's a great idea for kind of executives to really start thinking about how they can better collaborate internally and also outside with partners. Be bold, uh, be excited by this, don't sort of pretend that it's not happening because if you do pretend it's not happening you will be left behind. <music>《Digital Transformation》is not a buzzword. It's affecting everybody. It's putting businesses out of business. Bob Chambers, a couple of years ago, uh, stated that 40% of the businesses we know today of the top 500 would be out of business inside 10 years, and he's absolutely right. Uh, Organisations that don't change uh, will fail. Organisations that stand still will fail. Technology is enabling the change in the market, whether all of the well-known examples like Airbnb, if you take things like Netflix on streaming media, etc., we all know those examples. You will fail as a business because you will fall behind the market, you'll lose your differentiation, and you won't even keep up. If you don't start your digital transformation journey, you'll quickly see uh, your share erode you'll see pressures on your revenues and profitability and depending on how your market is being disrupted uh, you could be completely wiped out in a very short period of time and, and it sounds aggressive in nature that statement but it's absolutely true we've seen it elsewhere in the market so you have to get onto that journey to ensure you either lead or can keep up uh, but to do nothing is not an option